Hey everyone, it's Ethan Ormes back again for another video today and welcome back to the channel guys. We're here again uh, for yet another vital video. I'm super excited for today's video. We've got the third of fourth uh, Fighting Demons vinyls arrived finally. Uh, this one actually didn't take that long. This one um, is the HHV Germany exclusive, which I believe I could have got at Sunrise Records for like another or uh, 40, 30, 30 to forty dollars cheaper. Unfortunately, I think, at least, I'm not hundred percent sure. But nonetheless, of course, another Fighting Demons vinyl, like I said, uh, and this one is in like absolutely pristine shape. This one looks fantastic. So, finally, one that looks phenomenal. This one also feels smaller uh, than the previous two, but nonetheless, let's open it up because I believe. Uh, this one definitely could be my favorite colored uh, of the vinyls, but we shall see. So, let's open it up, because uh, this is, uh, obviously if you've seen by the title of the video, this is the blue uh, exclusive, so let's take a look. I'm very excited. Again, this one is in really, really good shape. Very slight bends on the corner, uh, up, 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 up at the top right, sorry, but literally like... Apart from that, it's in really great shape. It looks very, very nice. Again, this uh, comic panel is awesome. Uh, it's very, very nice. I really, really love it. I'm intrigued to see if it's a little different uh, in here than the previous ones. It doesn't really look like it, but nonetheless, of course, the album cover uh, on both sides. And when you open this up, the credits to every song uh, on the project. And another Juice World image, which is very, very nice. Very, very happy about this one as well. So now I have uh, three of these, I believe. I believe they're all the same. So let's take a look at the vinyl now. I'm very intrigued to see what this looks like in person. Let me see if I can put this back in. There we go. Like I said, I am very intrigued to see what this looks like in person. So let's take the vinyl out. Let's take the vinyl out and let's see what it looks like. So, uh, very, very nice, of course. Uh, yeah, looks to be the same images on these ones as well. But, uh, ooh, ooh, that looks very nice. All right, let's take it out for you guys. So, the Fighting Demons blue uh, vinyl looking very, very nice. That's a very nice blue, uh, a color that I definitely don't have uh, in my collection yet, which is very cool. This is very, very pretty. Uh, it's, there's a bit of marbling in it as well, which is pretty cool. That is a very, very beautiful color. That looks incredible. I'm a big, big fan of this. Man, it's crazy how fast dust collects on these things. Uh, nonetheless, though, here, just a quick little view for you guys. Hopefully you can see uh, the uh, marble that I was talking about and that looks very very awesome. That looks incredible. Like that looks so that looks so pretty. Like I said, definitely don't have a blue like this in the collection, so that's nice. I was expecting a bit more of a lighter blue to be fair though. Um, it looked like a lighter blue on the website when I had ordered it. And I had actually ordered uh, two records that are HHV exclusives, uh, which you guys will see the other one uh, not not long after this one, uh, I would imagine. So, yeah, very, very cool. I'll throw this one back in here. That was, of course, side A and side B. We'll take a look at side C and D out of curiosity to see if it's any different, but I'm guessing it's not uh, any different. And, of course, the same images from the robbery photo shoot and uh, the cover for Already Dead. But yeah, looks pretty much identical. Still very, very nice. Very, very pretty. I really, really like this one a lot. This is a really nice color that I'm a big, big fan of. I'm very, very happy with how that looks and I'm excited to see how it sounds. Uh, I had seen someone had commented on my last uh, Fighting Demons uh, vinyl video about the Target exclusive not sounding very good, which was that red uh, OPAC um, cover or cover album that I had showed you guys. So I'm intrigued to see how this one sounds. Personally, I haven't had any issues with the Target exclusive one. Uh, I don't know how well of it or how great HHV ones are. This is my first HHV exclusive, so 
uh, I'm excited. I'm excited to try it out. So uh, let me know what are, what is your uh, sorry what is your guys' favorite vinyl so far out of the ones we've gone through. Like I said, we've gone through three. So of course the standard black, the Target exclusive opaque red, and then now the H HHV exclusive uh, blue vinyl. So we've got one left or one less? No, one. Well, I guess one less. We have one left. Uh, which is the, I believe, black translucent one from 999 Club. So I'm very excited to see what that one looks like. Some of the translucent ones are really, really cool. So, yeah, three down, one to go. I'm very excited. Again, this one is in great shape. I'm very happy about that. So, uh, yeah, that'll be everything for today's video, guys. Uh, again, let me know which one is your favorite vinyl so far. Uh, I'm probably going to make a, collect a collection video on all four of them once I get them, which I think would be pretty cool. So uh, yeah, thank you guys all so much for watching. Hopefully you did enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.